Hey, how's it going out there, y'all? Everybody still out there hanging out? Wow. Y'all, this is incredible. I can't believe that we're here right now. Um, this is super cool. Thank y'all for the patience in us getting set up. Um, we are so thrilled to be here with you all. Um, I'm Becca, and this is my husband, Cody, and we came from South Carolina to be here with you all. And we're so, so excited and grateful and thankful. <laughs> So here's a song we wrote called Slow Lane. Um, I was a bad driver for a long time. Cody didn't like it. He was always white knuckling with me. And I was just, you know, you know when you get kind of upset, other people on the road are just not doing the right thing. And, um, you know, you can carry that kind of energy around with you and it can just kind of weigh you down and make you heavy. Um, and that was happening to me. And I read this, um, book called Don't Sweat the Small Stuff, and there was a passage, and it talked about, you know, isn't it funny how that person that weaves in and out on the highway, you always end up at the same red light with that person. It's like, what did that? What good did that do you? Um, started thinking of that as an analogy for life. You know, I'm gonna opt to just drive in the slow lane. You might notice some more things that way and um so it took a couple years to write this song we live on a street in columbia south carolina where people kind of fly down that road and that would always bother me um and we had a little kitty cat her name was penny lane and she was my best best baby girl and i knew against my better judgment i shouldn't let her out but that's just how she was. So there was an accident one day. I, I don't know who did it, but we lost Penny Lane. And they were flying down the road, and it devastated me. I was wrecked. Um, and it caused me to write this song called Slow Lane. So I hope that you like it. Driving down the interstate, all I see is red tail lights. Everybody's in a hurry, and so I let them pass me by. It's funny how the world spins past every day. I don't know about you. But I sure could use a break I'm driving in the slow
Thank y'all. Thanks, everybody. It's funny, I was um, telling some people earlier, so we flew in today, and uh, as you could imagine by this wind, it was pretty rough <laughs> landing out here. Um, but as soon as we got out of the airport, Becca was driving, I was like, Becca, look, there's cactus right there. <laughs> Pulled and over we had in the to stop lot. and take some pictures of it, because that's just, that's wild, man. Y'all yes. just, just see that stuff all the time. It's wild. Y'all crazy. This is wild. <laughs> well, y'all, um, you know, we want to just kind of take a moment and think about this man, Stefan George. You know, um, we, we're going to take home some CDs of his, um, and that is who this songwriting competition is named for. And, oh, you know, we're just really excited that we can be a part of this this year and honor his legacy and it's amazing what music can do um and what it brings to people you know it's just it is it's really this amazing divine thing and i don't mean we also want to thank the tucson folk festival y'all give it up for all these amazing folks who put this on um year after year this is the 39th year and we're we're grateful to be here so our second song today the first one was really uh one that becca kind of took the lead on and, and wrote that song about how she was feeling. And this next song is one that's really special to me. Uh, it's about my grandparents. Back home, I called them Mama and Papa. And um, they were together for 50 years. And this song is about the time when my Mama had passed away. And I was kind of watching my Papa live on without her for the first time in half a century. And uh, he was just trying to find ways to continue to honor her while she was not uh, around anymore. And it's about that. So it's called Love You Somehow. I cut down that pecan tree it was hanging over the house, lost those 20 pounds. You always stayed on me about, and I keep thinking one day I'm gonna walk back in the house and you'll still be there. And you'll tell me it's about time. to keep my end of the bargain the one we made the day we said our vows and I'll keep crossing off the list the things you wanted fixed I'll try to show you I still love you somehow Things you wanted 
it best, I'll try to show you. I still love you somehow. Mm. Thank you.